Hello my friends, this is Dr. Mandel. Your muscles don't actually grow when you're lifting weights at the gym. They grow and rebuild when you're resting, when you're sleeping. That's when your body is repairing the microscopic tears in your muscle fibers. And here's the truth, if your body doesn't have the right nutrients available at night, you're missing the very window when muscle growth and recovery actually happens. When the world finally grows quiet at night and you close your eyes, your body begins a process that is far more powerful than most people ever realize. Your muscles torn and strained from the challenges of the day enter a stage of deep repair. What you do during these silent hours will determine if your body wakes up stronger or weaker. The truth is that your muscles don't grow in the gym, they grow when you sleep, but only if your body has the right nutrients to fuel that miraculous rebuilding process. Four vitamins taken at the right time can completely change the way your body recovers and ignoring them could mean years of slower progress, nagging pain, and untapped potential. Science has shown that during the deepest stages of sleep, your pituitary gland releases growth hormone, the very chemical that drives muscle repair. But without magnesium, that growth hormone surge is incomplete. Magnesium is the mineral of relaxation, the natural tranquilizer of the human body, the nutrient that tells your nervous system to calm down and let go. Studies show that magnesium deficiency is linked to poor sleep quality, higher cortisol levels, and weaker muscle function. Imagine pushing your body hard only to let stress hormones tear away at your gains overnight because you lack magnesium. Foods like spinach, pumpkin seeds, almonds, and even a square of dark chocolate can replenish this vital mineral, but most people never get enough, and the cost is felt in their restless nights and sore mornings. And then there is vitamin D, often called the sunshine vitamin, yet so many live in the dark without it. Low vitamin D is not just about weak bones, it's about weaker muscles, higher injury risk, and slower healing. In fact, research published in the Journal of Clinical Endocrinology has linked vitamin D deficiency directly to muscle weakness and impaired performance. Think about it, your body can train, your muscles can tear, but without vitamin D, the blueprint to rebuild them is missing. Taking vitamin D at night doesn't hurt its effect, what matters is consistency. Pairing it with healthy fats like salmon, avocado, or even a drizzle of olive oil ensures your body absorbs every drop. And while the world sleeps, that vitamin D goes to work, strengthening the connection between calcium and muscle fibers, making sure your contractions are more powerful tomorrow than they were today. Vitamin C is the protector in this story. Every workout leaves behind microscopic damage, and with that damage comes inflammation, swelling, and oxidative stress. Free radicals tear at the edges of your recovery, threatening to undo the work you've done. But vitamin C stands guard, neutralizing those free radicals and calming the storm of inflammation. Athletes who lack vitamin C not only heal slower, but also experience more joint pain, weaker tendons, and brittle ligaments. Collagen, the glue that holds your muscles, tendons, and joints together cannot form properly without vitamin C. It is the silent architect of recovery, and ignoring it means building your body on a shaky foundation. A single kiwi at night, a handful of berries, or a slice of bell pepper can be the difference between waking up sore and stiff or energized and renewed. But recovery is not complete without vitamin E, the partner of vitamin C, the shield that guards your muscles as you drift into sleep. Vitamin E is not just an antioxidant. It is a circulatory booster, ensuring that oxygen and nutrients travel efficiently through your blood to the very fibers that were broken down during training. Research from the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition has shown that vitamin E supplementation improves muscle strength and reduces oxidative damage after intense exercise. Imagine your muscles gasping for oxygen as they rebuild. Vitamin E makes sure that oxygen arrives on time, that nutrients are delivered, that repair is accelerated. Foods like sunflower seeds, almonds, and avocados provide this vital nutrient together with vitamin C. They create a wall of defense around your muscles as you sleep. The most shocking truth is this Millions of people push themselves at the gym, sweat, strain, and sacrifice, yet they unknowingly rob themselves of recovery because they go to bed nutrient deficient. They chase strength during the day, only to lose it at night. They believe that supplements alone will save them, yet they ignore the timing, the combinations. The science that shows us recovery is as much about what we put in our bodies as it is about how we move them. Growth hormone peaks at night, muscles knit themselves back together, protein synthesis accelerates, but without magnesium to calm the nervous system, vitamin D to activate repair, vitamin C to build collagen, and vitamin E to guard against damage, that process is broken, incomplete, and wasted. The difference is visible in the morning. One person wakes up groggy, stiff, weaker than the day before, their muscles screaming for nutrients they never received. Another wakes up energized, their body subtly stronger, their tissues quietly rebuilt, their recovery complete. The only difference lies in what they chose to fuel their body with before sleep. Your muscles are not asking for drugs, not asking for shortcuts, but simply asking for the basic nutrients that human biology has depended on for thousands of years. Without them, your body is in constant debt. With them, you are unstoppable. When you lie down tonight, ask yourself, are you giving your body what it needs to heal? Or are you silently sabotaging your own growth? 
Because the truth is that real strength isn't built in the gym, it is built in the hours of rest, in the silence of sleep, in the chemistry of recovery. Magnesium, vitamin D, vitamin C, and vitamin E are not optional extras. They are the foundation of overnight muscle repair. Science has made this clear, yet the world continues to neglect it. Don't be one of them. Let your nights work for you. Give your body the tools it craves, and in return, it will give you strength, energy, and resilience beyond what you thought possible. Tonight could be the turning point. Tonight could be the night your body truly begins to rebuild itself the way it was always meant to. When the sun goes down and your body prepares for rest, every choice you make can either accelerate your recovery or quietly destroy it. The truth is, most people sabotage their own sleep without even realizing it, and the culprit often hides in something as small and harmless looking as a vitamin. We've been taught to believe that vitamins are always good, that more is always better, that timing doesn't matter. But science paints a very different picture. The human body is a finely tuned system, and when you take the wrong vitamins at the wrong time, you can shatter your sleep cycles, elevate your stress hormones, and block the very repair you've been working so hard for. Two vitamins stand out as the biggest offenders when it comes to nighttime disruption, and yet millions unknowingly swallow them right before bed. The first is vitamin B12, a powerhouse of energy production and brain health, but at night it becomes your worst enemy. Vitamin B12 acts like a spark plug for your nervous system, boosting alertness and waking up the very circuits you are trying to calm. Research from the National Institutes of Health has shown that vitamin B12 increases melatonin suppression, the hormone responsible for putting you into deep sleep. Imagine this, you go to bed exhausted, but instead of sinking into the restorative slow wave sleep where muscles rebuild and growth hormone surges, your brain stays wired, restless, and alert. Every toss and turn is a silent signal that your body's repair process has been interrupted. Athletes who take B12 late in the day often report lighter sleep, more nighttime awakenings, and slower recovery times. Even if you sleep seven hours, the quality of those hours is hollow, shallow, and broken. That's why experts recommend taking vitamin B12 in the morning when its energizing effects align with your body's natural circadian rhythm. But at night, it's like trying to floor the gas pedal while you're supposed to be parked in the garage. The second culprit is vitamin B6, often hailed as essential for neurotransmitter production, mood regulation, and metabolism. And while B6 is critical, timing is everything. Studies have shown that high doses of vitamin B6 before bed can trigger intense dream activity, sometimes even nightmares, leaving people drained instead of refreshed. The University of Adelaide conducted research where participants who took B6 reported significantly more vivid, emotionally intense dreams, often leading to fragmented sleep. But here's the darker side. While vivid dreams may sound fascinating, What's really happening is that your brain is spending more time in lighter stages of REM sleep and less time in the deep restorative stages your body desperately needs to heal. Without deep sleep, your growth hormone secretion plummets, your muscle repair slows, and your immune system weakens. This is why people who supplement with B6 at night often wake up feeling tired, despite technically sleeping enough hours. It's not the quantity of sleep that matters, it's the quality, and B6 can rob you of it. The shocking reality is that millions of people unknowingly take multivitamins at night, which often contain both B12 and B6, believing they are doing their bodies a favor. But instead of helping, these vitamins are hijacking their recovery, disrupting the hormonal balance that controls rest, and keeping the nervous system in a state of subtle overdrive. This disruption doesn't just cost you one night of sleep. Over weeks and months, poor sleep accumulates, cortisol levels stay higher, blood sugar control weakens, testosterone drops, and muscle recovery slows to a crawl. And the terrifying part is that you might not even realize what's causing it. You blame stress, you blame age, you blame your mattress, but the truth is often sitting inside a pill you swallowed right before turning off the lights. Consider this poor sleep is now linked to increased risk of heart disease, depression, diabetes, and even shortened lifespan. A study in the European Heart Journal found that people with chronic sleep disruption had a 48% higher risk of heart disease and a 15% higher risk of premature death. Now imagine combining that risk with nutrient timing mistakes that you thought were helping you. It's not just about feeling tired. It's about silently cutting years off your life. Your muscles, your hormones, your immune system, your brain all depend on quality sleep to function. Growth hormone peaks during deep sleep, testosterone regenerates, your immune cells recharge, your brain clears toxins through the glymphatic system. But the moment you introduce stimulatory vitamins like B12 and B6 at the wrong time, you interrupt these processes. You create microfractures in your recovery that accumulate into chronic fatigue, stubborn fat gain, weaker muscles, and mental fog that no cup of coffee can fix. Yet the solution is so simple it almost feels absurd. Take B12 in the morning when your body craves energy and alertness. Take B6 earlier in the day, when its neurotransmitter support helps you think clearly and stay focused. Reserve your evenings for nutrients that calm, repair, and restore. Magnesium, vitamin C, vitamin D, and vitamin E work with your body's natural rhythm, while B12 and B6 fight against it. It's a paradox of modern health. 
The same vitamin that fuels your vitality during the day can quietly destroy it at night. And unless you respect the timing, you will never unlock the full potential of your recovery. The people who thrive, who build stronger muscles, sharper minds, and deeper resilience are not the ones who simply take more vitamins. They are the ones who understand when to take them. Timing is the hidden key. Every night your body is begging for deep rest, but when you throw in the wrong nutrients, you are effectively telling it no, no to growth, no to healing, no to energy, no to longevity. And while you may not feel the damage immediately, over months and years it adds up until you're left wondering why your body feels older, weaker, and slower than it should. But tonight can be different. Tonight you can choose to align with your body instead of fighting against it. Tonight you can stop unknowingly sabotaging your recovery and give yourself the gift of true rest. Your sleep is the most powerful therapy you'll ever have. Protect it. Respect it. Do not let the wrong vitamins steal it from you. Because when you guard your nights, your days transform. Stronger muscles, sharper focus, a healthier heart, a longer life, all of it begins not in the gym, not in the kitchen, but in the silence of your sleep. Every rep you lift, every sprint you run, every drop of sweat you shed is not where growth happens. What if I told you that the hours you spend in the gym are nothing more than a trigger? and the real transformation of your body doesn't begin until you've stopped moving. The shocking truth is that your muscles do not grow when you're working out. In fact, in that very moment, they are breaking down, the iron you lift, the strain you feel, the fatigue you push through, it's all tearing microscopic fibers apart. Exercise is controlled damage. And the only reason your body allows that damage is because it knows it has the tools to rebuild stronger, thicker, more resilient muscle tissue, if and only if you give it the chance. The growth happens when you rest, when your body retreats into stillness, when your nervous system shifts from fight or flight into repair mode. During this time, a symphony of biological processes begins. Your pituitary gland releases growth hormone impulses, primarily during deep stages of sleep. This hormone signals your tissues to rebuild, repair, and grow. Without enough deep sleep, growth hormone levels plummet, and no amount of time in the gym can replace that loss. Studies from the University of Chicago have shown that just a few nights of poor sleep can reduce growth hormone secretion by nearly 70%. Imagine training with intensity, believing you're building a stronger body, only to find out you've been cutting your progress in half simply because you didn't respect the recovery process. Protein synthesis, the very foundation of muscle growth, doesn't peak during your workout, it peaks afterward during recovery. Your body takes the protein you eat, the amino acids circulating in your blood, and stitches them into the fibers you tore apart hours earlier. But here's the dark side without adequate rest, that protein synthesis stalls, and instead of growth, you're left with weakness, inflammation, and fatigue. Athletes who chronically neglect rest don't just stop progressing, they start regressing, their performance declining, their immune systems collapsing, their risk of injury skyrocketing. Overtraining is not a badge of honor. It is a silent thief, stealing the very gains you are chasing. Sleep is not just about closing your eyes, it's the single most anabolic state your body will ever enter. During slow-wave sleep, your testosterone levels surge, fueling muscle development and recovery. But research shows that men who sleep only five hours per night experience testosterone levels similar to someone 10 years older. That means every sleepless night is aging you, weakening you, eroding the very foundation of your strength, and women are not spared. Poor sleep disrupts estrogen and growth hormone balance, impairing recovery and increasing fat storage. Sleep deprivation is not just inconvenient, it is destructive to human performance and longevity. Cortisol, the stress hormone, tells the other side of the story. When you train, cortisol rises, it's part of the process. But if you never rest, if you never let cortisol drop, it becomes chronic. Elevated cortisol breaks down muscle tissue, stores fat, and damages your immune system. It turns your training into a cycle of destruction with no repair. And the most shocking part is that chronic cortisol from lack of rest doesn't just affect your muscles. It shrinks your brain, weakens your memory, and accelerates aging at the cellular level. Scientists now know that rest is not optional, it's survival. Your body operates like a construction crew. Training is the demolition, tearing down the old, stressing the structure, pushing the limits. But rest is the rebuilding crew, laying down new brick, reinforcing the walls, strengthening the foundation. If you demolish a building every day and never let the crew rebuild, eventually all you're left with is rubble. That is exactly what happens to millions of people who push their bodies hard but never respect the recovery process. They grind, they hustle, they sacrifice sleep, thinking it's dedication, but science proves it's self-destruction. Even professional athletes, those at the peak of human performance, have learned that recovery is the secret weapon. LeBron James reportedly sleeps 12 hours a night. Roger Federer, the tennis legend, says he sleeps the same. Why? Because they understand that their careers, their performance, their very survival in elite competition depends not just on how hard they train, but how well they rest. They know that rest is where adaptation happens, where the body transforms stress into strength. 
And here's the part most people miss rest is not just about sleep, it's about nutrition, hydration, and active recovery. When you feed your body antioxidants like vitamin C and vitamin E, you're reducing the inflammation from training. When you replenish electrolytes like magnesium, you're calming your nervous system and preventing cramps. When you consume protein at the right times, you're providing the building blocks for repair. But none of it matters if you don't give your body the hours it needs to stitch those pieces together. Science has shown that muscle protein synthesis can remain elevated for up to 48 hours after a workout, which means your rest days are just as important as your training days. Skip them and you are literally throwing away potential gains. Think about this, the most common reason for injuries in athletes is not lack of training, it's lack of recovery. Torn muscles, ruptured tendons, stress fractures, these are the results of bodies that were asked to perform without being given the time to heal. Recovery is not weakness, it is the foundation of strength. Without it, you are not training, you are destroying yourself. Every night you go to sleep, your body is faced with a choice, repair and grow, or remain broken and weak. That choice depends entirely on you on whether you allow the process to happen or sabotage it with poor sleep, poor nutrition, or constant stress. The science is clear muscles grow when you rest, not when you train. The gym may ignite the fire, but recovery is the oxygen that allows it to burn. Without recovery, the fire dies. With it, it becomes unstoppable. So the next time you think staying up late, skipping sleep, or pushing through exhaustion is a sign of strength, remember this, your body does not reward destruction, it rewards balance. Real strength is built in the silence, in the stillness, in the hours when no one is watching. Every rep is meaningless without the recovery that follows it. Respect your rest, and your body will reward you with strength beyond measure. Ignore it, and no amount of effort will ever be enough.